Hey everyone, welcome back and thanks so much for joining me again today. If you guys have been watching, you know that I have been on somewhat of a lucky streak. So I pulled out a whole bunch of new surprises out of Camp's Toy Box today. And I'm hoping to get some like really special, special um, items today. The other day I opened the Pick Me Pop Season 2 and I got one of the super sets. There's only three of those available. I got one. I'm completely determined to get the rest of them. I'm still on the hunt for the uh, golden hatchimal egg. That would be amazing. And I'm really, really excited to try to get the ultra rare of the LOL pets. So let's see what we get today. Hopefully my lucky streak will continue. Our first one is a Num Nums uh, Series 5. These are little yogurt cups. I've gotten some special edition ones. <gasps> Where's the collector's guy? What? Did this one not come with a collector's guide? How weird is that? That's never happened. Oh my gosh. That is so crazy. They forgot to put a collector's guide in there. All right, let's see what we have. Oh, we got one of the ones out of the marshmallow uh, category. <gasps> this looks delicious. I do not have this one. All right, I'm not sure who it is because I don't have the guide. I have another one, so I'll go get it in a minute, but let's check out this numb. Super, super delicious looking. This must be a nail polish, right? A polish it numb underneath. Oh my gosh, I love this like striped handle. That is so super cute. All right, let me get a guide and we'll see who we have here. All right, so it's a good thing I hold on to my guides, right? That's so crazy. All right, so here we have our marshmallow squares category, and this is sugar mint. Looks absolutely delicious, doesn't it? Oh my goodness. And on the back is our noms. Here's our polish it noms. We have, oh, it's cotton candy. I should have figured that out, right? With the little swirls and everything. Super, super cute. All right, not a special edition, but I'm really excited because I don't have these ones yet, and I definitely love adding to my collections as well. So this is, the new blind boxes from Littlest Pet Shop. This is series two. These are super, super cute. I just started opening these. Look, it has a little key ring on top here. And you know what? This one's a little bit different. Uh, most of the ones I've opened have been like a white color. This one is a, this nice green that matches the box. So let's see what we have going on in here. This is really fun. So there's two blind bags in these new blind boxes. Here is the collector's guide. Shows you all the different little ones to collect. They come with these little habitats and then these teeny, teeny, tiny little pet shop characters. All right, so let's see who we got today. Oh, I don't have this one. Oh my gosh, I see adorable ears. Oh, look how cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. It's like a little puppy, right? It looks like a little, maybe like a little schnauzer or something. What a little cutie. Look at those ears. All right, so check out the habitat. It's a dog house. I love it. So you pop your little teeny Littlest Pet Shop guy on top of here. How cute, right? Reminds me of the uh, rings, right? The wear ones, the wearable ones. And then I guess I have to slide this on like this. Oh, I don't want to knock his head off. I'll put it over. Oh my gosh, how adorable. And he's in his little dog house. So it comes with this little hooky thing where you can put this on here and then you attach it to the key ring that comes on the box right here. So you open that up and you slide it off. Isn't this cute? I think this is so cute. It's like so much fun. You don't just open like a little surprise. You get to actually put together this really super cute little keychain set. But wait, there's another blind bag. I think it's gonna be another one of those little hangers. And some of the habitats have a key and a lock where you actually have to open it up. Aw, look how cute. That's adorable. It's just like another little um, like accessory that you can put on your keychain. This one's really cute. I like it. So you can put that on there, close it up, and you've got accessories and a key ring and a really super cute littlest pet shop character. Super fun, right? I told you that one would be fun. And I don't have it either, so that's a great one to add to my collection as well. All right, this is a little tip can box from Shopkins. It says, I love Shopkins. We got Strawberry Kiss on the lid, which means that this is a Strawberry Kiss themed box. So everything inside of here will have Strawberry Kiss on it. So on the bottom, it tells us we get three magnet cards over 150 stickers and a mini poster. These are from Bullseye Toy. They have some really, really super cool products. So here are our 150 stickers. They come with this really large roll with all of our favorite Shopkins characters. Look at all those. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's so many, right? All 
So in here is our mini poster. And of course, it is Strawberry Kiss. <laughs> and I love Shopkins. And then you get these really cool magnet cards with Strawberry Kiss on them. And these are really super cute too because you can pop these out. They come in like a little frame. If you push on it, it pops out. And then you can hang it up just like that. It'll stick to anything metal. You can decorate the actual box with it because the box is made out of tin. Or you can put them on your refrigerator. Anything that's metal. So that one will pop out too. There's this little S for Shopkins that pops out as well. And then Strawberry Kiss here and a little cute heart. Really, really adorable. Lots of stuff in that little box, right? All right, what should we do next? Let's do the LOL Surprise Pet. Super exciting. And this is the Series 3 version. Seven layers of surprises to uh, unravel and open up. Pull down the zipper on the first layer. And we get our secret message. We have a little girl, looks like a little fairy, and a dog with an arrow pointing to its tail. Fairy tale. That's kind of an easy one. I don't get them all the time, but that one was pretty simple. So we go to our next zipper. And our next little layer surprise is a collectible sticker that tells us we have to add water to our doll or add the doll to water to see if it changes color, spits, tinkles, or cries. Next zipper. And that unwraps our bowl. Give it a squeeze. Pop it open. Inside you have the little handle. You can attach that to your bowl, make it a little carrying case. Inside of here is this really cool molding sand. And there's also a surprise tucked into the sand. It's really, really cool. A lot of fun. And we have our collector's guide. There's some directions in here. And, of course, several different blind bags. Oh my gosh, so many. Look at all this stuff. All right, let's open the smallest ones first. Oh, and our first little prize is this little scooper. Oh, look how cute it has like a little bunny in there, little bunny ears. And this is what we're going to use to scoop our surprise out of our kinetic sand or our molding sand. Up oh, and in here we have an accessory, little headband. Little bow on it, right? Really cute in black. This should be our doll's or our pet's water bottle. Yep. Little bottle in blue and black. And let's check out our pet. Oh my gosh, look how super cute this one is! Oh, how adorable! We got a little bunny rabbit! Oh my gosh, this is so, so cute. I love this one. So I guess you put your little headband on. Oh, I love this one, guys. I'm really in love with this. I know it's not the ultra rare one, which I knew right away when I saw the pink ball, but this one is so super cute. I can't help but be excited. So let's check out the guide. And this is Cottontail Cutie. What an adorable name. From the Storybook Club. And she's got a little light blue symbol, which means that she is a popular doll. Or a popular pet, I should say. And these little symbols tell us that she is going to either cry or spit when we add water. Oh my gosh, she's too cute. First, let's go into our kinetic sand and see what um, surprise is waiting inside of here. So this is super fun to play with. I really love this. Ooh, we got a pretty blue color. Check it out, it has that little LOL. It has like little paw prints in the sand. We're gonna use our little scooper and we're gonna scoop through here until we dig up, oh, a surprise. I see something gold, you see that? What have we got in here? Aw, it's a little, aw, it's a little like teacup. Oh, look how super cute this is. Oh, it's got the little bunny symbol on it. And even on the inside, it's got like the little bunny's head. How cute, I love this little accessory. Aw. All right, let's get some water and see what our pet is gonna do. Okay, I got a bowl of water here and either we can use the little cup and fill it with water and give our little bunny a drink, or what I like to do is just to put her right in there and if you squeeze the head, she will pretty much drink the water herself. She'll suck it all up. 
And then we can just simply give her another squeeze and we'll see what she's gonna do. I'll bring her nice and close here and let's see what she does for us. Oh, she spits. Ah, she just spit on my leg. <laughs> oh, yep, she is definitely a spitter. Super cute though. Okay, let's do our blind bags next. I'm gonna save the pick me pop for last. I'm so, so hoping to get another super set or even just like a rare or an ultra rare. That'd be cool too. Our first blind bag is a Hello Kitty collectible minifigure. I love these. I open them all the time. They're super cute. Series one, and this is called the costume collection. It comes with Hello Kitty in all these different like Halloween costumes. They're super, super cute. There's two rare ones to try to um, collect as well. And they have question marks, they have mysteries. I opened one the other day. It was like this pink mirrored looking kitty it was so cute Let's see what we get today Ooh, it's a ninja <gasps> this is cool i don't think i have this one yet look she's got like a little ninja star i love it she also looks like kind of shiny and metallic this is cool oh i like it and i love that she always says her uh, her bow outside of all of her costumes right because that's what makes her hello kitty that's really cute i love this one. Oh my goodness our next blind bag comes from Animal Jam. These are the deluxe trading card blind bags. These are also from Bullseye Toy. Super, super cute. You get 14 trading cards in here and an Animal Jam figure. They come with um, all these different kinds of cards, like the base cards, they have 3D cards, pop-up cards, fuzzy cards, and even coloring cards. You also get a really cool um, game code, which will help you unlock something in the game. So these cards are so super cute. They have the picture of what it is, of what the animal is, what, says what it is, and on the back, it gives you all these awesome facts about the animal on the front. So here we have a seal, and it tells you how long the seal is, how much it can weigh, um, its conservation status, which means if it might be like going uh, on the endangered list. It tells you a little bit about its habitat and some fun facts. So each card is really informative. I love learning about the different animals. Here we have a super cute sea turtle. Oh my gosh, an octopus. I think they draw them so well too. They're really, really nice. We have a, a, a wolf, how cool is that? This is the uh, game code card. This one is a little pop out card, right? Check that out, pretty cool. Here's a lemur. <laughs> oh, we got another seal, we got two seals. Oh, two sea turtles, we got a couple of duplicates. Here is a tiger, a toucan. Aw, super cute penguin. Oh, we got another octopus. We got three duplicates. I don't usually... Oh, what? Another sea turtle? Listen, I don't usually get that many du duplicates in one um, pack, so that's actually very surprising, but still super cool. All right, like, so let's do our Hatchimals. Oh, my gosh. Trying to find the golden Hatchimal. I still don't know if the egg is gold or if just the Hatchimal inside is gold. Have you guys seen anybody open these yet? All right, let's see. Season two. I'm on the hunt. So it's definitely not a gold egg. It does have yellow speckles though. So you know what to do. We rub the heart until, wow, that happened fast, until it turns pink, which this one turned pink so quickly. Give it a squeeze. Break open the shell. No, doesn't look gold. Let's see what we have inside of here. I don't have this one, so this is cool. Oh, look how super cute. Oh my goodness, look at all the little spikes. Let me get my collector's guide. We'll see who this is. All right, so this little cutie is, of course, a draggle right there, and it's from the Savannah category. Has the little silver wings, which, of course, means it is a common Hatchimal. Super cute, not the gold one, but again, at least I got a new one to add to my Hatchimal collection. That's always exciting. All right, our next blind bag comes from My Little Pony, the movie. Oh, I don't have this one either. Oh, yes, I do. <gasps> My pick me pop just rolled away. <laughs> this is Apple Bumpkin. I actually do have this one. Look how super cute the little cutie mark is. It looks like little, um, like maybe caramel apples. Really, really pretty in this pink and yellow color. And it says she's always loyal to her friends. On the back of the card, it shows all the different um, other ponies to collect in this wave. Really, really cute pony. I love it. All right, let me get my pick me pop back. Okay, so here we go. Season two, pick me mop, pop. This is the, the medium size of these. It comes with two sweet scented plushes inside, plus four different surprises. I've been getting all different cool surprises, so I'm definitely enjoying this season. All right, 
right, so super cute purple vessel. I think this is my first uh, purple vessel, so that's exciting. Maybe I'll definitely get something different today. All right, so check it out. There's so many blind bags in here. Oh my gosh, you gotta give it a big squeeze. Look at all these blind bags. So, so many different ones. So of course you get the little stand. You can put your vessel inside the stand. I'll put that back here. Oh my gosh. Let's start with some of these flatter ones. See what we have inside of here. Inside of one of them will be, of course, the collector's guide. And what is this now? What do we have? Oh, these are so cute. I like these ones. I do not have these ones yet. These are little nail decals. They're really, really cute. You just peel them off and you stick them onto your fingernail and it looks like you got your nails done right at the salon. But I guess with um, pick me characters. <laughs> really, really cute, right? Let's see what's inside of this one. Okay, okay, so we have our two little messages here. We have this sticker, so this shows us which Pick Me uh, plushes we have inside and their flavors. Which, what is that? I thought it was marshmallow, but it's not. It looks like, like sugar cubes. What is that one? Is it on here? I don't even know. Maybe that's not it. So here's our collector's guide. Let's see who we have. Ah, uh, we got Snowy the Polar Bear. Really, really cute. And this is Puff the Ram. That's cool. I definitely don't have these ones yet. Let's open it up. Oh, it's caramel apple scented. Let's have a woolly, uh, a woolly amazing day. Like really, but woolly instead. That's cute. And let's see what Snowy's has to say. Oh, you're so cool. Get it? Ha ha, because he's snowy and cold. That's funny. What surprise do we have in here? Oh, look at this. It's like a little uh, charm. Comes on this really cool little dangling string. Aw, and this is like a, a lion, right? Looks like he's holding a pineapple. <laughs> Super cute, very rubbery. Oh, that's a good one. I definitely don't have that. Oh, and it looks like we may have a, a dangler in here. Oh, I didn't open this one yet. I thought that was the same bag for a minute. Oh, look at it. It has like, that's so weird. It's all pink. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, this one's so totally different. What is this little thing? Usually it comes on the string, right? All right, let's open our Pick Me Pop plushies and see what they look like. Aw, this must be snowy. Look how cute. I love it. It's white with blue little snowflakes. That is adorable. It's super soft too, guys. Oh my gosh, and it smells unbelievable. <laughs> like really unbelievable. I cannot get over how good these um, products smell. It's ridiculous. Oh, it's totally woolly. Look, look at the ram. I love it. It feels so cool. Oh my gosh. All right, let me get the collector's guide because I really want to see what um, rarity these ones are. Are they common? Are they rare? What do we have here? Where are our characters? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so here is Puff the Ram. So they are common. There's Puff right there, and here's Snowy the Polar Bear. So these two guys are common, but I didn't have them. I have them now. I'm super excited. If you want to see, these are the ones I opened the other day. I got Kimchi the Red Panda and Lufa the Lion. So if you want to check out that video, definitely go to my most recent um, videos, and you'll see it in there. So, so cool. They're foil. They're amazing. All right, guys, so check out all the super cool products we opened today. While I didn't get any ultra rare or super sets or anything like that today, we really got some super, super cute stuff. So that's a successful video in my opinion. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give a thumbs up. Be sure to come back. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss a single episode here on Kim's Toy Box. I'll see you real soon. Thanks for watching.